Tony is here. Today I'm going to teach you how to use Parallel and installing Windows XP, provided that you already have Parallel on your Macintosh computer as well as Windows XP installer or 7 Vita or 8. Okay. First, you need to go to to click install Windows XP or another OS. Next, you need to find your local installer. You can search it here. Okay. Which I already have. Then click continue. Input your serial number, uh, product product key of your Windows XP. Next, uh, this is op optional. Uh, you can click like a map, which makes makes this Windows XP and its application work on Mac or Windows XP separately. I prefer this one because uh, it's a little bit slow if you make your Windows Windows application run on Mac, Mac a Mac a Mac like environment. And at the same time, I prefer I prefer it here because everything that uh, your Windows application will run on your Windows application with this uh, Windows operating system which is log most, uh, much more logical and easy okay uh, next you need to press continue and give it a name um, yeah give it a Windows name okay and continue give it a time Okay, I will more likely do a fast forward of this uh, installation because it will take time and I want this installation would, would be 10 minutes. Uh, Installing, 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 installing. Okay. But that was a fast installation, by the way. Very fast. Fast, actually. I thought I will be spending like two hours with this installation, but nevertheless, it's uh, fa super fast, easy, very easy. All right, parallel tools installation engine. This is the installation that will make you able to transfer file between your Macintosh and your Windows operating system. Uh, 
Uh, by the way, parallel is a, a virtual machine. It will handle you by virtual machine. It's like the physical machine, but on your operating system. Okay. It will hand. It can. You can solo on um, Linux operating system and I think Android. Yeah. You can install Android on this virtual machine. Provided that you have enough of space. Okay. Mm. It is shutting down. I need to close my application because after the installation, I don't know what happened. It's, it's just all the application that is minimized reveal themselves. I don't know. Okay, install this application. I thought it's already installed, but no, I think I need to click it. Again, which I already done. Yeah, we'll need to restart after I finish parallel installation. We can yeah, transfer files between Windows and Macintosh. Okay. Yeah. This is actually uh, if you want to access your files in Windows, I mean files in your Macintosh. Windows, Windows, Macintosh. You just need to click this. This is your parallel. Okay. Um, and yes, you can access your desktop, which I don't have that much. Yeah. This is my desktop on my. my uh, Macintosh and I will show you my desktop see the difference yep. yeah yeah no, that's not yeah this is the thing and this is the thing the same thing right okay uh, for if you want more tutorial please comment below or ask me uh, if you want to ask me any question just comment below okay thank you